First and foremost, I want to give all honours and praises and glory belonging to my Lord and Saviour, whose name is Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahabashai, Bahasham, Wahabakakwadash, and double honours to the elder apostles of Great Millstone that teaches truth well and to the hopeful elect across the globe and to the few, the very few brothers and sisters listening and also learning across the globe. This lesson is going to be called Esau's Silent, Silent Weapon. Because this, the scriptures talk about the wise men of Teman. The scripture says they are wise as Daniel. Esau has designed this theme for years and years and years. Weapons. He doesn't need to. See, people think Esau needs to kill you with his hands. Send out troops. No. Don't you know every single day he's finding another way to kill you without even him putting his hands on you? And the major way that's done through what? These different forms of what? Radiation. And I want to start off with the different forms. I'm going to name some of them. Okay. The first one, Mint Synth, includes radar, inte ra radar intelligence, okay, radar, where you know where someone is, that's that radar intelligence, acoustic intelligence, which is what, sound, nuclear intelligence, okay, which is all, this, this is all weaponry, radio frequency and electronic electromagnetic pulse intelligence and this is one of the most fierce I and mean, you got it right now doing this video guess what guess what's coming off this device radio what radio frequency weaponry and this is electronic magnetic frequency electronic electro optical intelligence okay laser intelligence materials intelligence unintentional radio intelligence that's a that's a lie esau's saying it's un what's it it's unintentional but it's intentional it's intentional to to, to melt your brain to cause sickness to cause retardation all these things chemical biological intelligence directed energy weapons intelligence what's it effluent Effluent debris collection, which you got different debris. You had something called um, ah, oh, what was the name of that years ago? What's that years ago? I forgot the name of it. Something that was in walls. I forgot the name. Asbestos, which kills you off. It doesn't kill you off straight away. And most of the people that died in 9/11, they didn't die straight away. I'm talking about the survivors. They died years later from what? Asbestos, that smoke, the debris with chemicals in it. Spectroscopic intelligence, infrared intelligence. So these are just all the different forms of what Esau's got. He doesn't need to lay hands on you to kill you. This is the depths of, see, a lot of you don't know the depths of this devil. You don't know his depths. So we're going to quickly go into the main one, radio frequency, Baba Kishar. Okay, because Esau uses all these things. And guess what? One way or another, it's like, if you're in the grid, if you're in these cities, you're being attacked by these weapons. Whether you know or whether you don't know, you're being attacked by it. If you've got a microwave, that's a weapon right there. If you have a TV, that's a weapon right there. If you have a phone, that's a weapon right, right there. You just don't know it. We're going to start off with that word radio. From what coming from rays and you got natural rays that what come from the sun the sun is a source of energy the sun is energy okay radio radially from what that means that word that comes from what radiant okay radioactive okay and this is what Esau does he uses these radios and he uses it for radioactive energy against the people and when you've got radio what that's transmitted, which is what transmitted energy. And Esau's using it all for the wrong things. Okay. 
and all these transmitters everywhere that's that's wired up with what the 5g and what's this doing it's killing off the animals it's harming the animals it's harming people as well that's why they got nausea they're throwing up they can't get to sleep all these different things why because of this technology and yes it's been proven to go right through the walls so if it's going through the walls the concrete walls can you imagine what it's doing to your body can you imagine the damage it's doing Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Let's go to that word frequency. And we're going to go to the word frequency. A state of being crowded. In fact, of occurring often. Because a frequency is a pattern. A sequence. Okay? Of noises. Okay? Which what? Gets you in a trance. So Esau was using this as weaponry. Because there's nothing wrong with technology. But how are you using this technology? And you go from that word Latin, it's frequentia. Something that's frequent is what? A pattern. And assembling in great numbers. And this is what Esau deals with. He deals with num numbers. He deals with patterns. Okay? A crowd and a crowd, a multitude are from. Okay? In physics, and this is all physics. I don't want to get highly metaphorical and all that. But this Esau deals with physics. He deals with numbers. He deals with patterns. He deals with sequences. He deals with vibrations. Especially of a vibration. Okay? As a system broadcasting is distinguished by amplitude modulation. Okay. And he sends these frequencies out by what he mediums. And you wonder why people are bugged out. Let's go to let's let's get the scriptures. Let's let's get the scriptures. It's gonna go to Corinthians, Baba Kasha. Second Corinthians 2 and let's go straight to 11 Baba Kasha. two and eleven lest Satan should get an advantage of us Satan is what the adversary you got the physical manifestation Esau on earth and you got what the spiritual demon Satan as well the state should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant. And you go into that word ignorant, it's idios, idiotos in the Greek. Okay, when you're ignorant, Esau can get away with anything, and you won't even know it. For we are not ignorant of his devices, and this is part of Esau's devices, and you wouldn't even know it. You think, oh, be what a beautiful phone. Okay, what a beautiful phone, what a nice phone. But what were phones for? Because Esau would tell you what it's for, telecommunication. You know? It's for telecommunication. No, it wasn't. It was to gather data. Okay, that's the main thing. It was to gather data and it was to destroy you. Okay? And melt your brain. Okay? These devices, see, see, Esau, the scripture says, the knowledge of wickedness, that's not wisdom. That is not wisdom. Esau, these things were created, there's nothing wrong, but you can have a phone without any type of radiation. That's why you had Tesla, okay, they stole his pattern, they, they done away with him. And you, you have others, there's technology that we can use, the TV, the phones, without receiving any type of radio, that, that can be done. This is treason. This is war upon the citizens. This is war upon the masses. So the, the hopeful that we're not supposed to be ignorant of these things. We're not supposed to be ignorant of these things. Let's go to Psalms 10 and 2. The wicked in his, in his pride that persecute the poor. And the poor is really speaking of what? The hopeful elect. And the rest of the nation of Israel. And even his own people. Even Esau does this to Esau. Because he doesn't care about his own people. Let them be taken in the devices that he have. So Esau is going to be taken in. All the devices that he's imagined. He's going to be taken. Including your new world order. Because new world order. What does it tie into? Tech. Technology. The system. Science. This is what he's building his new world order off. Science. This is what we're coming up against. Esau's. 
science. Okay. That's ESO's New World Order. The whole, what do you think the mark could be? What do you think it is? What do you think it is? Is technology, is science. This is what we're up against. Quickly go into that word technology. Technology, a treatise on the art of the arts, which are art is a craft, from Greek, technologia, systematic treatment of an art. And what's Esau building upon? A system, which is what known as the mark of the beast. Read Revelations 13 and 16. Okay, originally referred to a grammar from technical, techno, combining from technique, art, skill, craft, in work. And the scriptures talk about Esau being a crafty man. A cunning hunter. Method. System. An art or system or method or making or doing. And this is what Esau wants to do. Patting everybody to get to bow down what to the mark of the beast. Through that chip. A weaving or fabricating. Okay from root text to weave to fabricate. And this is what Esau wants to do. Fabricate his new world order. Brothers better start widening up in this truth. See, there's many aspects to this truth. Many. Bear me just a minute. Bear me just a minute. Baba Kasha, Baba Kasha. I know this is not by chance. Okay. Let's finish off on this. That's why this man needs to be taken out. Let's go to Matthew 24 and 22. And except those days should be shortened, there shall no flesh be saved. But for the elect's sake, those days should be shortened. So the days are being shortened. The days are speeding up. There shall no flesh be saved because this man is destroying everything. You ever wonder why these bees? I'm seeing bees everywhere as well. <laughs> That's a part of them frequencies as well. Okay, your 5G, all that rubbish. And the only reason why we're on it, because you may be asking me, well, why are you on here using the device? Just to do the videos, to push it out. But the sooner this, this kingdom shuts down, the sooner your Havishai comes back, the better. Because the only reason why we're using this is to push out the words. If it wasn't for that, I wouldn't even be on this at all. But with this lesson, I hope this was edifying. I hope this gave you a bit more understanding of what we're up against, this system. And until the next time, shout out to the hopeful elect. Shout out